I'm Wendy and I'm going to talk to you now about tuning your clarinet. So I have a B-flat clarinet here. This is like your normal student clarinet to start with. And this is going to tell you a couple of things that are the way of tuning a clarinet. Now the first way is to open up the joints of the clarinet to change the sound. Now, for example, if I play this note, which is G, and I'm trying to tune it with somebody else, and I find that my sound is too high, and it needs to come down just a little bit, now I'm not talking about changing key, I'm talking about if my G isn't in tune with what should be the same note for them, then what I can do is open up very gently by making sure I don't squeeze the, the keys the wrong way. Open up this neck joint in here, either a little bit or quite a lot, as long as it's still firmly connected. And you might hear that the sound has now become slightly lower than it was before. And then you can obviously adjust it back in a little bit until you get it exactly in tune with the other person. So you'll be listening to their sound and then adjusting it and trying it again backwards and forwards till you get it right. So that's the usual way of adjusting your sound as long as you're mindful about not having that too far open that it falls apart. The other thing that is a bit harder to do when you first start out though is to do with the way your mouth works when you play. If you play with lots of air in your cheeks like this, you might notice that I've got lots of squeaks because it's unnatural for me to play like that. But when you blow all the air out there, the sound tends to be quite flat and low, whereas when you play with a little bit of a smile and a bit of tightness here, which is getting a strong embouchure, not having air puffing into your cheeks, you have much more control over the, the quality of the sound and the pitch of the sound as well. So you can tighten your smile and get it slightly higher you can loosen your smile and get it slightly lower. So essentially we can have quite a bit of change between the, the puffy cheeks and the tighter embouchure. So they're the two different ways with your embouchure and with the joint here of tuning the clarinet to get it in tune with other players. And you'll find in bands and in orchestras and so forth that they have to tune or you have to tune to the other players to make sure that it's going to sound right even though you're playing in a different key. The most common thing though is to adjust here because changing your mouth position it can be quite complex when you're first starting out. So good luck with that tuning and if you need any help then feel free to chat with me on Facebook and I hope you'll like and share this video and that I'll speak to you someday soon. Bye for now.